This weekend I have been babysitting my dog because my mom is in Sweden. Say hi to Wilma. You guys may remember her from my vlog many years ago. As you guys can see, she's not really a camera pug. <laughs> that look pretty much says it all. What's up guys, Sunny here. Welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel. Happy new year. I am so glad to be back here on YouTube. I've decided that this year is gonna be my year. I'm gonna change things up a bit. I'm gonna do my best and I hope that you guys are as excited as I am. So I thought I'd start out the new year by making a little Q&A. It's a chill start. I think that's perfect. So yeah, without further ado, let's get to it. I asked you guys on Instagram to ask me some questions and you did, you always do, you guys are awesome. Uh, if you haven't followed me on Instagram yet, this is the time. My Instagram is at ishascakes. I may or may not change that up in the future, so as for right now, it's ishcakes. Yeah. Number one is just how are you doing? And honestly, I'm doing great. Like I'm starting my internship tomorrow. I'm super nervous about it, but at the same time, really excited. This internship will be like CT, MRI, probably a lot of other stuff too that I don't know yet. So I'm really looking forward to it. If you by any chance are gonna take a CT or MRI, maybe I'll see you. Other than that, I've had a lovely Christmas celebration. I've got a lot of awesome gifts. I actually wanted to make a video on on my Christmas gifts, but I decided not to because I was worried it may have come off as bragging and <laughs> I don't like it. I don't wanna brag, it's not my thing, so yeah. I'm doing good and I hope that you guys are doing amazing as well. Do you like your job? And and this person is one of my colleagues, so I, I know that she's talking about the indoor playground that I'm working at and honestly... <laughs> It's lovely sometimes and other times it's not as lovely, but in the end it's a job. I mean, I'm happy I got the job because I needed to get out of my freaking house. Also, I get to cook a lot of food, which is freaking awesome. It's my favorite part of the job actually, making food. What's your goals with YouTube and can you do more workout slash meal videos? Wow, that's a huge question. Like my goal with YouTube, it is to first of all spread positivity. I know it sounds cheesy and all that, but like honestly, it's my number one goal just to make your day a teeny tiny bit better. I try not looking too much at the numbers, but I find myself doing it all the time anyway, but I guess my goal for 2020 is to finally hit half a million subscribers. I've had this channel since 2013. We're really close to half a million. So it would mean the absolute world to me if we hit half a million together. It would be so awesome. I also wanna be more active both here on Patreon, uh, on all my social medias really. I, I feel like I've come to this place right now where I do not know what I want to make because right now, I do not really have that much time, so I don't have an entire day to film. I usually have two or three hours to film and it kind of limits everything, you know? I don't want to rush my content and I don't have the time to film for hours, so it's quite a dilemma. Uh, also, I really enjoy uploading videos that are interesting to me. Like, I love working out, I love making food, I love like just doing random things. And I, I, I kind of realized that not all of you guys are into that. Most of you are subscribed either because of my candy videos or my language videos or my <laughs> German videos. That's actually an entire category right there. Uh, so I'll try my best keeping everybody happy, but also doing what I love because I think that's important. Else I'll be burnt out and I won't really be that interested in making videos. So my YouTube channel will always be like just a freaking dumpster. I'll make whatever. It doesn't have a topic. It's just the way it is. I hope you guys are cool with that because yeah. Jack asks, goals for 2020? If you want to share, of course. Keep smashing it, Sunny. My goals for 2020 is to get freaking fit. <laughs> My goals for 2020 is to achieve success. And by that, I mean that I have a couple of things that I want to achieve. Uh, one of them being that I want to focus more on training and my health and what I eat and etc. I really want to look good and feel good. Other than that, I want to be happy with my grades in school. I want to work hard and get good grades 
and just achieve success. My YouTube channel is also a huge one here, but I spoke about that previously, so I don't wanna get too deep into that once again. Uh, but I want to grow my channel. I want to grow my community. I want to get to know more of you guys because yeah, I don't really need to explain that. I think that would be awesome. Next question. Have you ever visited Switzerland? No, I have not. But I want to go there in the future. Who's your biggest celebrity crush? Celebrity. That's apparently a word that I cannot say. Anyway, uh, my biggest celebrity crush. I mean, I always got to be loyal to Zac Efron. He's always been my biggest crush ever since High School Musical 1. He has a special place in my heart. I actually think he owns my right atrium. So that's where Zac Efron from this, my right atrium. Recently, I've really been fascinated by Adam Driver. Like, it's not that he's necessarily that attractive, it's just something about him. He's so mysterious. And I also love Star Wars, so like, hello Kylo Ren, marry me. <laughs> Oh, I feel bad for him. Would you consider creating your videos in Norwegian with English subtitles? I've done that once before actually, and I think the video was actually quite popular. People loved seeing me speak Norwegian. The problem with that is that it takes a lot of time because I have to translate everything and subtitle everything. So it's really time consuming. And like I said, I don't really have a lot of spare time. I'm usually at school for eight hours or at work for eight hours. And I've actually found out that I have to travel for two hours hours each way to my internship so that will be four hours in total of traveling every day so two hours to my internship and two hours home and eight hours at the internship itself so that will be 12 hours a day that i'm not even home so yeah i i I hope that you see where I'm going with this. Of course, I want to spend it on making videos, but I also want to spend it being with my family, being with my friends, going to the gym, you know? I, I need to take care of myself, you know? Are you in college or university? If so, what are you into? Um, I'm currently in university and I'm studying radiography. I've said this multiple times, I think, but I mean, I don't expect everybody to watch all my videos, so <laughs> yeah. I study radiography, it's really fun. It's everything with race, basically. X-ray, CT, mammography. I don't know if it's actually called that in English. Intervention, nuclear medicine, all that stuff. It's really fun, really nerdy, I love it. What do you think about Sweden and Swedish people? Dude, I love Sweden. I actually went there the other day to buy a candy. I haven't traveled all Sweden, of course. I usually go to places near where I live. I love Sweden. I don't have anything against Sweden. I love Sweden. How do you define yourself? This is an interesting question. Uh, I define myself as a kind person. I'm quite shy. Uh, that's one of the things that I don't like about myself because it prevents me from doing a lot of stuff. Sometimes I can be really stressed out about stuff. Like if I have to do a lot of new stuff, I, I usually get a headache because I stress too much. Not good either. Like when you get to know me, I, I think a lot of my friends would describe me as funny. I think it's really hard to define myself, but I just know that I'm pretty much happy all the time. I smile a lot, I'm, I'm laughing a lot and I'm shy. What equipment do you use for your videos? I use a Canon EOS 70D for my camera. My lens is uh, a 10 to 18 millimeter Canon wide angle lens. I use a Rode VideoMic Pro as the microphone. Hello. I also use a studio light from, let me see newer. I bought it on Amazon. <laughs> it's on an umbrella light and it works fine, I think. I don't know. I don't know a shit about cameras. I'm such a noob. I also have a tripod from Camlink. That's it. I kind of want to get one of those microphones that you can attach here because I think that would make my videos way better because I could use my freaking creative Sigma whatever lens. That's really awesome. It's not called creative. It's called art. Sigma art something. It's really cool, but I need a mic that I can place here. So if you have any suggestions for a good mic that I can attach to my t-shirt, please let me know. Do you ever get fans approaching you on street? Uh, no, not that often. It has happened a few times, but not often at all. Most people message me saying that they've seen me somewhere and they don't really approach me. So, I mean, that's sad. I really want people to approach me because I think it's nice. Did you like the new Star Wars movie? I loved it, holy shit. I was sitting there in the cinema like, what? It was so eventful, like I could not chill for a second there. Uh, 
It made me cry, it made me laugh. Like the droids, holy shit, they're so funny. They made C-3PO even funnier than he usually is in R2-D2 and, oh, and freaking BB-8 and oh, this little thing, I can't remember the name of it. I hate when people bash the movies just because it's not like the originals. It, of course, it's not like the originals. Nothing will ever be like the originals, but it's something new and it's awesome. I loved it. All right, I'm gonna answer one more question now and it's time to wrap up the video. I feel like I've been speaking for hours now for some reason. Where exactly are you from? I am from Norway and I currently live near Oslo and that's all you will get to know about me. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to smash the like button. Why do I always keep saying smash the like button? Like you're gonna freaking beat it. Like, I mean, you can do that if you want, but like, yeah. When did I start saying like all the time? I'm like so so excited about the 2020, like what? Okay, I'm gonna stop now. All my social media links are listed down in the description below. I also have a Patreon page if you wanna follow me there. I haven't been the best at posting there, but I try. If you guys have any ideas of what I can do with my Patreon, please be sure to leave it below and I'll check it out. Thanks a lot for watching. I love you guys and I'll see you guys probably next Sunday with another video. Bye! Yes.